Hello students, welcome to Drama Club. This week we have an exciting script for you. The Adventure of Princess Polly. So let's start with scene one, where we meet Princess Polly walking through the forest. Over to you, narrator. It was the time of great healthiness across the kingdom of fairy tales. In every house and every castle, across the land there was a beautiful gardens full of the most wonderful kinds of vegetables, from tasty avocados to lip-smacking zucchinis. But not everyone was happy about this situation. I am literally sick of being healthy. You think you've got problems? Try being a frog. Frog smog. All I want is to go to 7-Eleven for a rainbow Slurpee and a chocolate muffin. Well, all I want is not to be a frog. Oh, please, Ferdinand, give it a bone. So you're a frog. Count your lucky stars that you're not a toad. Hey, look, Polly, there's something stuck in that tree. I wonder what it is. Oh, it's an envelope. How mysterious. What do you think could be inside? Only one way to find out. Later. Princess Polly opened the envelope to find a one-way ticket to Candyland, the most delicious land in all the world. Oh golly gosh, Ferdinand! It's a one-way ticket to Candyland! All my dreams have come true! And so with the promise of fairy floss and liquid sticks, Princess Polly said farewell to Ferdinand, packed her bags and set off in search of Candyland. And we end scene one, and over to scene two, which is at the gates of Candyland. Princess Polly arrived at the gates of Candyland, and there she met a talking scarecrow. Hello, and welcome to Candyland. I am so excited, all my dreams have come true. That's what they all say. Please, what is your name? I am Princess Pollyanna of the Lucky Charm Palace, which is on the corner of Queensway and Brown Street, two doors down from the Gongcha Bubble Tea Shop. Let me see. Princess Millie, Princess Omi. Oh, here you are, Princess Polly. No, uh, pardon me. Do you want a glass of water? No, thank you, but I think that you should have. Should what? A glass of water. Whatever for? I have a one-way ticket to Candyland. From now on, it's milkshakes and soft drinks for me. I don't think so. Why don't you think so? Because it says here, you're from the kingdom of fairy tales. That is correct. Well, it says here that the kingdom of fairy tales is currently in a lockdown. You do not have permission to enter Candyland. But I want to go to Candyland. I'm sure you do. But the kingdom of fairy tales is on a level four healthy eating restriction. So you, dear Polly, cannot go to Candyland. Oh no, what bad news. Don't be sad, Polly. Have a cracker. Thank you. The good news is that at least you'll be sugar free and very healthy. I guess so. And so Princess Polly returned to the Kingdom of Fairy Tales. There she met her friend Ferdinand, who had turned back into a prince. Together, Polly and Ferdinand opened a healthy food shop that sold avocado muffins and zucchini slurpees. And I am very pleased to say that Polly and Ferdinand were very successful and both lived healthily ever after. The end! And let us thank, thank our cast, the narrator, Golan.
Miss Para Murphy, Princess Polly, and Mrs. Drummond, the Scarecrow, and Ferdinand. Well done. Happy learning, students. Thank you.